Hello and welcome to sunny Woking. I hope you appreciate my lovely hat I got from Mexico. I've got a cider as well, don't tell anyone. I thought I'd blog about today because it's going to be quite interesting because we have David Curtin coming to Woking, which is where I live. And an added bonus to it is I'm also part of this organisation called Stand Up in the Park. I say it's part of it, there's no official leadership structure. It's just something which I've helped carry along with all the rest of the people doing it. And it's basically people who are against the restrictions meeting up in the park and talking about everything going on in the news and what they will do for their jobs and their livelihoods. And recently there was a case where there was a woman who is lives in um, near Woking and she got contacted by the police for putting a leaflet up on a village hall notice board, which was anti the restrictions and giving uh, information about how restrictions can affect people's mental health and things like that. And so the police told her that she needs to go on a crime prevention course um, or else she might get prosecuted. And this crime prevention course basically looks at your whole situation. It assesses your mental health, your financial sta stability. Uh, it's real 1984 um, authoritarian stuff. And this is the kind of world we're entering in. We just heard recently about the 12 year old girl who got visited twice just to check that she was self isolating. This is the kind of lunacy we're entering. So it's going to be great because David Curtin's actually going to meet up with this woman and we're going to do a short video about it. So I'll do a little blog today. I'm just about to go to the pub now and meet David. And then we're going to go meet this woman. And then David's going to do a talk later. So I'll post videos throughout the day. Catch you later.